I'm Che Otayamba Taylor, founder and executive producer of the Game Changers Project. I'm here in Oakland, California, where I recently caught up with Chris Johnson. Chris is the founder of Question Bridge Black Males, a transmedia art installation that seeks to redefine and represent black male images. Let's go take a look. This is one of the strongest and most consistent expressions of black male voices that has ever been done, as far as I'm aware. And so we have a real sense of commitment to try to create as many appropriate settings for that as possible. As you walk in, we consider this almost a sacred space. Um, the thing that people who come here first notice is that the um, pillars that have the men represented on them is curved. Mm. Um, so the value of that is that it creates a kind of um, space that you're included in. Right. So this curve is something that all of the different installations that um, are appearing across the country, um, that, that's the way it's arranged. And we were very, very particular about the way this was set up. And so here at the Oakland Museum of California, we really done a wonderful job of rendering it exactly the way we as artists decided to curate it. And the idea behind this project is to give people who witness it the sense that they are silent, privileged witnesses to the conversation going on between black men and themselves. And like I said, one of the things that's important about this is to try to give the impression that everyday black men are the ones who are carrying not only these very heartfelt questions, but also the deep wisdom that comes from the black male community about these concerns and issues that black men have with each other. So um, the, the idea of this being something that includes not just black men, but everybody is the way it's designed, and that's what I think comes across. Were people very candid naturally, or did you find that you had to do a lot of takes? Or? Yeah, that's a very good question. Um, we began this as an art project, which meant that um, unlike journalism or science, we didn't really have any predictable idea of whether men were going to respond the way we wanted. Um, and so it could easily have been that all the men that we encountered said, no, nah, I have nothing to say, I have no questions. Um, but instead, every single one of them said um, that they had something that they wanted to contribute. Um, so I think that what that speaks to is the fact that in our culture, there are very few opportunities for black men to really speak directly and openly and be trusted with their own voices, um, much less give answers to these complicated questions. And so every man that we encountered had something important to say. So tell me about this. There's no audio. We just see the images kind of rotate. What, right. what was the um, intent with this? Yeah, we wanted people who experience it, for example, here at the Oakland Museum of California, to really understand that this project is about the most inclusive expression of black men possible. But as you move past this, the image goes from being sort of fuzzy and diffused to sharp. And that's a way of saying that um, your perceptions of black men start out as just that, projections, with, which may have no real reality um, to who they are as people. But your view of them changes depending on your perspective. And so that's one of the conceptual things we tried to build into the way this is structured. Um, all we did was simply say to every black man that we encountered, um, do you have a question you've always wanted to ask another black man? And they all went, yeah, I do. They gave us those questions. And then they, they had these profound answers. And that's how the content of Question Bridge came to be. Okay, last question. What is your definition of a game changer? The, the coming together of time and a person who um, is able to um, synthesize oppositional forces um, in history. I mean, that I think, um, when it happens, um, changes the game for everybody involved. You know, obviously looking at um, Malcolm X and um, Martin Luther King and, and Rosa Parks, I mean, you know, the people who've inspired our generation um, happen to be the right personality in the right circumstances at the right time, and I think that will change the game. But one of the things that I, I want to say about um, Question Bridge Black Males is that every person can embody the possibility of change in their lives. And there's really no accounting for what the implications of that are. I hope that everybody who comes to this project recognizes that they can find within themselves the capacity to change. And that's what I think um, all the projects that the Open Society is supporting is trying to do. Absolutely. So I'm Chris Johnson. I'm the originator and co-director of Question Bridge Black Males. That's appearing here at the Oakland Museum of California. And I am a game changer.